Okay. Go ahead. And, We're good. and I'd like to uh, yield to Representative Timmons. Okay. Thank you, my friend. Um, I want to correct the record. It seems this entire hearing, we're chasing all of these logical arguments that r really don't have any merit. And earlier, before we uh, recessed, we were discussing the ranking members' uh, 7.8 million in foreign payments from at least 20 countries during his presidency. And I knew the answer. I knew that that was revenue. And it wasn't actually profits. Hold on, I'll, I will let you ask questions at the end of this. And you said, did I read the report? And so I did. And in the report, it actually specifically says, these uh, included payments from foreign governments and foreign government owned or controlled entities to properties owned by Donald Trump, including Trump International Hotel in DC, Vegas, Fifth Avenue. And this is my favorite. Trump World Tower at 845 United Nations Plaza in New York. So let's just use that one alone. Because if you go down to page 20, uh, footnote 23, it actually clarifies where this money came from to include the amount of money. And so what y'all did is you took a building that was built in 1999 and completed in 2001. And you have, it's 100 yards from the United Nations. So these foreign countries owned uh, multi-million, 10 million, 20 million dollar condos in one of the nicer buildings in New York. And I was just kind of shocked because I knew that you were using revenue and you weren't using actual uh, profit that the president or the Trump organization made. You actually used HOA payments. Do you know how <laughs> duplicitous it is for you to use HOA payments on a 20 million dollar condo in New York? Like, it is outrageous. It, no, 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 you can, I, I'm going to go through. We're going to go through all of them because you list them, you list them. And I see Saudi Arabia, $615,000, $422,000, Trump World Tower. And you go and you look, there's nothing there that is under $10, $12 million. So you're taking a $12 million property that was owned since 2001, and you're saying that this is somehow similar to Hunter Biden running all over the world and selling the big guy's influence? These are completely different things, and the fact that you even created this report and you're using it to shield us pursuing justice to make sure that this president is not compromised because his son has sold secrets to China, to Ukraine, is so disingenuous, it's so duplicitous. It's not even mis misrepresentation, it's a lie. I'm happy to hear this from you because, again, you told me to go read it, I read it, that's what it says. I can read you in footnote 23 where it says, this report uses common charges or rent payments all of these properties were owned prior to 2018. They didn't go out and purchase them because of the president. They were there for decades before this happened. That's the point. That's the difference. Okay. Uh, well, with, the with the gentleman, we have a good story. With, with Absolutely. The gentleman, yield. Thank you, my dear friend, for engaging in substance and not ad hominem attack. I very much appreciate that. Having said that, um, some of the payments. You, first of all, you said that there are lies in here. Can you find one? Factual inaccuracy. So There's not for, one. For you to in tell fact, you're quoting us. You're for quoting, you to, for you you're quoting us. So, but, but let me you, but let me for, let me make this point. Let me make this point, which is that I, I, China I gave 5.5 million dollars. It's, 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 it's Mr. Timmons' time. It's Mr. Timmons' time. For you to tell the American people that 7.8 million dollars went to President Trump is an outright lie. It's a fabrication. It hold on, hold on, and I'll tell you exactly why. Because you're using benefit. You're using businesses that existed decades prior to when he became president. And you're saying using, all of them? Hold on, hold on. And you're using HOA fees for multi-million dollar properties that have been around since 2001. And again, even the fees that they pay for hotel rooms, that is a fee for a, a product, for a service. There's no service with Hunter Biden other than influence of the vice president or the president of the United States. And that is why we are here, because he will not answer questions in the exact manner that you have required for last Congress and the Congress before that. I, I mean, it is difficult to chase all of your logical fallacies surrounding this, but at the end of the day, he's gonna do exactly what Don Jr. did. He's gonna do exactly what you required of every other member, except every other person you've subpoenaed, except for members of Congress who actually do have uh, immunity, which you're pretending like you don't know what that means. Um, we need to get to the bottom of this. The American people demand it. Mm -hmm. And with that, Mr. Chairman, I yield back. Excellent. Mr. Does any other member wish to speak? You wish to speak on the amendment? Yes. Ms. Stansberry.